Hello, this is Francis from McCaffrey's Crafts and today I thought I'd make a video with some weird requests that I've received throughout the years as a shillelagh maker and there have been a few. Uh, like on a weekly basis I get the weirdest requests and I thought it'd be fun to, to kind of share some of the, not the most recent ones because that's, that's you know, too weird, but uh, some of the older ones that, I, that I've got that are, are pretty weird. Like, like for example, um, like one time I got a request from this this guy and he wanted a root ball handle but he wanted two roots sticking out and they had to resemble the breasts of his first girlfriend that he really liked but she got away and he was always thinking about her and he married someone else and he told me he wrote a novel like in this email telling me the whole story of how it was and he wanted he, he was very particular the detail this guy had for the, the breast that he wanted is one had to be bigger than the other, one had to be just down to the side. Like he had been really thinking about this for years, about this this uh, this old girlfriend, the one that got away and stuff like that. And he just wanted to, you know, when he's walking with his stick and holding his hands just to be whatever, <laughs> getting some kind of memory out of it as well. So I, I thought that was like um, a pretty strange request um that i got uh you know one time that that you know that that guys want and you know sometimes people want something weird like that or like sometimes like there's actually just a it's a, not as like a, as weird as that but what kind of there was a guy who contacted me before and he loved uh, tom and jerry the cartoon you know about the cat and the mouse that are always killing each other that probably uh you know pretty violent and stuff like you know as as this modern woke culture we'd have now imagine you know if they grew up with tom and jerry <laughs> what they think you know like that's that's but it was harmless like you know the, uh, the you know they're only cartoons so anyway going to it there was um there's an episode of tom and jerry um with willy wonka um in it and i don't even i didn't even know willy wonka and tom and jerry had it like a cartoon movie and there was a stick that Willy Wonka had like an old kind of uh, uh, stick and the guy contacted me and he just said I want the, the walking stick from Tom and Jerry and I was very confused because that's not much information to go on and I was like okay do you have a picture and he goes no don't you know it don't you know it you should know as a stick maker and I hadn't got a clue and a lot of people they do that sometimes they assume that I know something that is quite common knowledge to them but not to, to me and eventually he just said willy wonka willy wonka and I, I i didn't know he said i'll pay you anything i'll pay you anything and i was like okay i'll, I'll try to figure this out so i watched the willy wonka movie again and he, he had this like you know walking stick but it wasn't anything like a black thorn and i kind of took a little screenshot and said is this what you want no no not at all anyway i eventually tracked down that there's this tom and jerry and willy wonka cartoon and you know, the guy forced me to, to, to watch it. And, you know, it, I have better things to be doing in my time now than, than watching cartoons. And, uh, you know, there's there's this, like, scene where Willy Wonka has this kind of, like, club-like type of walking stick. And he goes, yeah, that's the one I want. And it was ridiculous looking. Like, you know, it, you, it's it's a cartoon that someone drew and he wanted this this walking stick. So so that's kind of that's kind of weird. So sometimes people will see something. And, uh, like, the most common request I got, it's not really weird, I suppose, is from the gangs in New York, the, the Monk McGinn one that, that everyone wants. You know, they see the gangs in New York and the, the Irish actor Brendan Gleeson is holding this big giant cudgel with one hand and waving it around and he's marked off a little mark for every person he's killed with it and stuff. But if that was really a black thorn, it'd be completely impractical. It'd be too heavy to hold as well. Um, you wouldn't really be able to kind of wield much with that. Um, so, yeah, I just thought I'd just tell you just those two weird requests and, you know, I might do a few more videos on them. But I get I get plenty of, of very strange kind of customization requests. Again, it's just something fun, you might think as well. So thanks for watching.